Hey guys, welcome back. Sorry, it's really sunny. Um, if I turn it, it kind of works. Um, welcome back. If you're new, my name is Shannon. I am behind the Stitch With Love podcast and also my Etsy shop, Stitch With Love NZ. I, prop, at the time I'm recording this, I haven't posted it yet, but by the time you are seeing this, I would have recorded and posted a video about me trying out a cheap ball winder from AliExpress. It did not go well. I talked in the last podcast about how in the Facebook group I'm in, someone was selling a ball winder. It's arrived. Now I would lift up and show you the box, but one side has my address, the other side has her address. So we are not going to do that. But I'm going to unbox it on camera and I am also going to record me using it. So it's gonna, it's a lot of tape. Just checking again that you can't see any addresses. Because that's not good. This is the instructions and things. Sorry, if you can hear my cat, she's just by my feet. And you also might hear some noise from outside. So our landlord, his mother-in-law actually owns the plot big store. And I think there was a house on it, but then they got it removed and now they're building a new house. So there's workmen next door. And it's a little bit noisy at this time of the day, but hey, it's all good. They did warn us about that when we moved in. So we weren't shocked, we weren't surprised. Sorry, there's a lot of tape on this because obviously not wanting it to split open during transit. Sorry guys, this might take me a little while to um, get this open, I think, for some reason. I can't figure out how this box opens. It should not be that hard to open a box. Oh, opens the other way. That explains a lot. I opened it, I tried to open it the wrong way. There we go, we're in. It's another box for Ash. And more bubble wrap. This box is mostly <laughs> uh, this, Hold on. Moving all the bubble wrap out the way. I'm so excited. Is this? No, that's more bubble wrap. Right, we'll get rid of that box. And now we'll get it out of the bubble wrap. So, a little bit about this. Sorry, I will not be looking at you guys probably while I talk about this because I need to see what I'm doing. Um, so a little bit about this full winder, what I've been told. It's from Fiber Art Supply Co. in the States. Is it an electric one? Um, and so I have heard good things about this brand but because it comes from the states I've never seen one I've never used one 
but my gosh, it can't be any worse than the one I used last week. Ugh. And I'm also excited, just excited to have a wooden one. Just heard it much better. Right, so I've got to figure out how this all goes together. Just what instructions are for. So this is it at the moment. So I'm just going to pause this for a minute while I figure out how this goes together and I will be back. Hey guys, I'm sitting on my floor. I've, oh that's just a table clamp. Right, I probably am not going to use the table clamp though. I've got it working. Um, yay. I, it took me way too long to figure out how to put on a drive band. <laughs> Here it is. This is my noble winder. I'm very excited. I'm actually going to try and rewind one of the skeins that I wound. Actually, no, I'm going to rewind one from my current. So, not rewind. Basically, wind it into a ball. Um, it's like a weird skein thing at the moment. So. I'm just gonna pause this. I'm gonna clean my clean my table because I have random cups on here from my coffee, and I will be I will be back in a minute. <laughs> hey guys, you can't really see me, but um, and I was gonna record on my table, but I've decided no, I'm going to record on my floor. So this is the scheme, by the way. I'm currently using it to make some baby, blan baby blankets for a charity. If you want to see how that goes, um, how that's going, I would recommend following me on Instagram, which it, my Instagram, where you will see this, is at stitchlovenz, but you can also follow me at shamarie2401. These will all be linked below. Um, just for some other updates on some other projects as well, like my own knitting. That's not, um, sorry, I'm just going to find the instructions. Um, that isn't business related. Counterclockwise, so we're going this way. Oh, this is so much nicer. And it's so quiet. Right, I'll stop it in a minute. It looks so neat. The only thing that doesn't is that top bit there, but I imagine it will kind of work its way out. Oh, hi Ash. Anyway, I'm going to do a time lapse for the rest of this, and then I'll be back after. So I've just wound two balls um, into cakes. Uh, this is what it looks like off the winder. Oh my gosh, lighting is terrible. This this one's a little bit messy because it was my first one and tried to learn how to use this. Plus the yarn kept uh, just being a pain. So the bottom, oh, all of it looks a bit messy. There's the middle. The second one, though, worked so much nicer. And I'm just going to pop this one off now. It's falling out the butt for some reason. Ugh, lighting is terrible today, but that's okay. So I now have two. This one is a lot. I think it's the tension on this one's better. 
I'm still learning how to use one of these. So, final thoughts. I love it. It is so much easier and I have a lot of yarn that needs to be wound. So this is just so good. And as you saw, I could wind on the floor, which is good. I mean, it hurt in my back a little bit. But my coffee table is really thick, so if I want to wind in the front room, it's easier to do it on my floor. And it's so quiet. Whereas the other one was like, no, nah, 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 as it was going, so. Yeah, final thoughts, very happy. Definitely worth paying more money. I definitely learnt my lesson. And yeah, this will be the end of this. Um, yeah, I can't think of anything else I need to say. Um, yeah, just thank you for watching. If you like my content and you want to see more yarny related goodness, hit that subscribe button. Oh my gosh, this light. Sorry, I've got weird weather today. Mm. Um, yeah, hit that subscribe so you don't miss the next video. Leave a like if you like this video and I will see you guys next time. Bye!